Hey everyone, it's Ravena with another video. This time I'm going to show you how I fight fire. The first thing I do is talk to an NPC. They will aggro me if I'm close. I back up and then fade if necessary. Then I pull a mob. The first few pulls I just like to split with fade. When I have a few mobs I then pacify or punt to get a single. I don't like to passy pull the first few mobs because I always get a pack of them anyhow. After the first few I just passy pull and I usually get singles. The pulling is basic bard stuff. As for the kiting, I just use four dots and go in a circle. Every mob out of the first 12 is practically the same. It is pretty basic as well. The final four mobs are definitely the hard part. I invis up before they arrive because they will auto aggro. Whenever I am ready, I use my four dot melody to pull. They will all come at once. I just kite them in a large circle. Sometimes I use my dots to take down all four at once, and sometimes I kill one at a time and take breaks in between. Every so often a mob is stunned and removes the dots. I make sure I know where the mob is at so I don't kite into it when it unstuns. Every mob in the mission can summon at 5%. The first 12 aren't a problem, but when one of these summon me, they're all hitting me. This makes it very dangerous. At 10%, I like to prepare by hitting Last Stand, First Spire, and Shielded Notes to give myself an extra chance to live. When the mob gets to 5% or under, it usually gets stunned. I continue kiting with Melody on while clicking Boastful Bellow and quickly follow up with Cacophony. I'm trying to kill it as fast as possible before it summons me. I don't do this before it stuns because then it will usually stun and remove the dot. Rarely does trying to burst it down before it stuns work, so I don't do it. After I kill one, Either I kill another, or I fade out and take a break. If I end up dying, then they will auto aggro when I re-enter the mission. I pop Death Dance and have my cleric up before I go back in. Then I fade while try and get to the bridge. If I want to be safer, I will use more defensive AAs. Sometimes my cleric merc dies, but that is okay, because my main concern is not dying getting back in. After these four are dead, I wait for it to teleport me. Then I say Grieving Soul sent to the NPC and it will punt me to Plane of Knowledge and I'm done. It usually takes me about two hours to mellow this, but I like being able to mellow something in the new expansion. As always, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, either leave a comment or find me in game as Raveno on the Birdtop server. And if you want to see more of my videos, be sure to subscribe.